हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू अनदर वीडियो ऑन माय यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस वीडियो आई विल शो यू हाउ यू कैन क्रिएट अ वेब हुक फॉर योर गूगल डायलॉग फ्लो चैटबोर्ड एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई विल यूज पाइथन प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेज एंड फ्लास्क फ्रेमवर्क नाउ लेट्स सी वॉट इज अ वेब हुक सो अ वेब हुक इज HTTP टी टी पी कॉल बैक्स वैन एवर अवर डायलॉग फ्लो नीड्स वेब हुक इट सेंड्स अ रिक्वेस्ट एंड विद दैट रिक्वेस्ट सम रिक्वेस्ट डेटा टू द वेब हुक दिस वेब हुक यूजिज एक्सटर्नल ए पी आईज एंड डेटा बेज टू जनरेट अ रिस्पॉन्स फॉर दैट पर्टिकुलर रिक्वेस्ट एंड इट सेंड्स अ रिस्पॉन्स with some response data to dialog flow and then in turn dialog flow will show that response to the user for the development of a web hook and to follow this tutorial you will need ngrock installed on your system so that we can have a public url and we can give that public url to dialog flow and that public url will divert all the request to our local host you will need dialog flow account also you will need python installed on your system a virtual environment created and flask framework installed on that virtual environment so let's get started also i will assume that you know some things about dialog flow and uh, web app because we are using those basic concepts here and i am not going to explain everything here but instead i will show how it works and how can you get started with a web hook for dialog flow so i will start with dialog flow and create new agent here i will give name youtube demo to the agent i will hit uh, create it it takes some time usually because it needs to create a google cloud platform project okay now the chatbot is created let's test the chatbot with hello okay you get the response hi how are you now i will create a folder and inside that folder i will start my visual studio code to edit the files inside this file i have a sample web app ready with flask so let's first test this i'm using conda so i will activate my virtual environment now i am in my virtual environment let's run python process web hook okay as you can see the web server is running and hopefully it will print hello world so the web hook is ready for development let's start ngrock i will start my ngrock engine it will give us public url make sure you use this https url we'll go to dialog flow under fulfillment section 
I will enable the webhook. I will paste the URL. Now I'll make a root webhook for that URL. Now inside the intents, let's go to the default welcome intent. Uh, delete all the responses. I don't want the response to be uh, to come from this default responses. Instead, I will enable the webhook and save this. So, when now I write hello, it will say not available and if, if you go to the diagnostic info, you will see that dialog flow has sent a fulfillment request, but fulfillment status says that webhook call failed and error not found because if you see here that it indeed came to the ngrock and it says 404 not found because we don't have that route ready and you can see the error here now what we will do i'll create a new route webhook methods post let's first get the request get json and force true and print the request I will say hello again again it will fail because we haven't sent anything now you can see the error is changed from not found to internal error because we haven't responded to the request but if you see that we indeed got a request from dialog flow okay let's just send Okay, hopefully it's running again. Let's now test. Hello. You see, we got hello from the other side. On the ngrock, it sends 200 status okay. We see here 200 status is okay, no error. And if we go to diagnostics info, you will see that fulfillment request was this. Fulfillment response was this and fulfillment status webhook execution successful. So, this is it for the video. Now, there are many things you can do here. You can process the request and go to external APIs and do stuff and then come back here and then generate a response and send it back to the uh, dialog flow. The code used in this is available on my git repository and the link for that is in the description. Thank you for watching. Peace.